Hey, how's it going guys? I'm Ruse and welcome to my channel. I hope you are doing well. You know, it's Saturday. I usually would make a story guide video, but I thought after chapter 7, you guys probably can do the rest of the story by yourself. So I didn't continue the guide. And I've been wondering for quite some time, what can I do for Saturday? And so I found Vanguard. I knew the existence about Vanguard a long time ago, but never took the time to actually play the game. So now I decided decided to give it a try and I must say this is probably the only TCG that relies this heavily on luck but I guess that is Vanguard's charm point. Well enough talking let's get into the deck rundown shall we? For my first deck showcase I would like to show you my take on Maelstrom. I'm actually missing another uh, reverse Maelstrom so I put uh, Demetrius as a placeholder. Now Maelstrom is a deck that focus on multi attacks like other Aqua Force deck but with the added bonus if you landed on the fourth or more attack you can get the extra effects and destroy one rear guard. Uh, Maelstrom also got this really awesome starter, Marios, that lets you search a Maelstrom card when it is the third or more attack of that turn and put another copy of what you search back into the deck. That way you don't actually lose your triggers. For the grade one, I'm bringing four wheel assault. This card is really handy to switch up your attacker with your intercept when you are trying to multi-attack. Then four perfect guard, a must in any deck, one penguin for draw, and four self damager. Maelstrom ha relies heavily on you having four damage, so this is a must to speed up your play. For the grade two, we have two Gregorios. Since our Maelstrom counts as Blue Storm, this will be 12k most of the time. And then two Tempest Assault and three Tidal Assault for that free multi-attack count. Three Basil to ignore Interstep while also setting up for multi-attack. And three more Self Damager because you really need that for damage. For the grade three, we have three Reverse Maelstrom. It's like regular Maelstrom but better because of the extra critical. One Demetrios because I am short of one reverse but his break right ability is not that bad. And two Glory Maelstrom for that delicious PG lock. To be honest I like Glory Maelstrom better than a reverse because even if the attack doesn't hit you can at least waste two opponent's cards trying to block him. And for Benedict, uh, if you're rich, you're most likely going to run Diamantes instead. But I think Benedict is good enough. You don't really have to go all out and make four Diamantes. And three, the OG Maelstrom. Well, that's about it for the deck rundown. Now, I'm sure you guys have your own take on this deck and there's plenty of really good Vanguard Zero YouTubers out there. Uh, but this is my beginner's take on Maelstrom. Anyway, let's take a look at the replay I got for you guys. <laughs> Our first matchup is up against Shadow Paladins, most likely Revengers because that is really popular right now. Uh, we get the first turn. I'm going to swap this heal trigger and keep the rest. We didn't get any grade 3 but we can search for that later. We're just going to ride Will Assault and pass. On their turn, they ride Dark Trumpeter, then attack our Vanguard. And they got Heal Trigger this early. That is very unfortunate. On our turn, we ride Tempest Assault, then call Tidal Assault. Now we're going to attack 3 times to activate Maria's effect and hopefully get a great 3. And we got our SP Maelstrom, so we got our piece for the next turn play. On their turn, they write Masquerade, then activate Dark Goat's effect to add a grade 3 to their hand. After that, they call Tartu, then activate her effect. Hmm. If they call that one, that probably means they have a Blaster Revenger on their hand. We got lucky uh, and hit our draw trigger, getting us another Basil. 
And on our turn, we ride Maelstrom. Uh, we can't really activate Maelstrom effect right now, and we don't really want them to get to 4 hits yet, so we just attack their rear and pass. On their turn, they ride Raging Form Dragon, then called a bunch of grade 3 that I don't even remember the name, then attack our Vanguard. They got two draw triggers, we should be safe with one health left uh, after this attack. On the last attack, we got a draw trigger. I would have liked if we got glory or m reverse maelstrom, but we'll make do with what we got. On our turn, we're going to call Basil, Gregorius, Veteran, and Will Assault. With this, we're going to get a clean 4 hits. First is Basil, they get a draw trigger, but our maelstrom should still be able to reach it. We're going to destroy their rear guards, then attack their vanguard, and drive check 2 kill triggers. Mario's effect triggers, and we got Glory Maelstrom. Then our Maelstrom effect activates, we draw another perfect guard, then destroy one of their back rear guard and pass. On their turn, as I predicted, they got Buster Revenger and destroy our Basil. Then they call Mana and activates her effect that will superior call a great one, then they call another great one. After that they enter the battle phase and kill our intercept and goes one attack to our vanguard. They activate raging form dragon effect to ride another one and attack one more time and pass. On our turn, we ride Glory Maelstrom, then call Basil, Tidal Assault, and Veteran. We activate Basil effect to ignore intercept. And battle, we got one hit in. Then destroy their intercepts. And then we attack with Glory Maelstrom. We activate his effect to disable their perfect guard. We hit a draw trigger. That's very nice, but sadly they got a PG and a grade 3, so we got blocked. On their turn, they call Tartu and activate her effect. And they call the rest of their hand. They activate Raging Form Dragon's effect to retire 3 Revengers to add a copy of him. But now I think they realize they can't pass our intercepts. So yeah, we got this in the bag. On our turn, we call Penguin Soldier to Soul Blast 2 to draw a card. We call another Basil just to piss them off if they survive. And battle. We destroy Tartu, then attack with another Basil just in case they got a heal trigger. And they did get one heal trigger. Very lucky. But we still got our Glory Maelstrom with his 2 critical. And their luck has run out and we win the game. Well, that's all for today's video. I certainly hope you in- I only played Vanguard for about 3 weeks now. Almost a month, but... And I quite enjoy it. I plan to do Vanguard video Saturday.